So what kind of you're a makeup artist? Uh, no, epoxy resin, like canvas. So, oh, like yeah. an actual artist. Oh, how cool. Yeah. So Very I'm cool. Kind of always like posture's not your friend. Up. No, it's not. Yeah. I, I wear like a little like, support thing to like make my <laughs> get your spine right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but yeah. It's just still, yeah, it's I'm tough. Like, uh, Hairstylists, artists, tattoo art, like the the positions you have to be in, yeah. are not really conducive to any type of posture that's good for you. You know, yeah. um, students also. So the hunching. Um, there are some things I can recommend to you outside of this for exercise type stuff. Um, wait, we can actually demo. I'll, I'll kind of show you guys something that'll benefit her. Uh, usually, this, you typically do this kind of in private just because of the way that the exercise is. But a lot of us with bad posture, we tend to like collapse this way. Yeah. So uh, you, know, you can use an exercise band or even like cables at the gym. But if you pull, kind of pull your shoulders like you're doing a reverse fly, yeah. a lot of the mistakes people make is they try to lift their shoulders like this. But what you want to do is you want to like come back and down. And then you just want to hold it there. But if you did that throughout the day on top of this doesn't look attractive, but <laughs> making a double chin, I know it doesn't look good, but that combined with this, if you just did it like regularly, it'll counteract. Cause the problem a lot of times like with wearing a support, like you've seen the posture supports yeah. that kind of force you here. The problem with those, if you wear them too often, all of the muscles that would have done that for you are now even weaker. So you think, oh, you're setting yourself, but you're really just making yourself yeah. worse. So I don't mind people wearing them a little bit, but if it's more than a half hour, not a, like people at Home Depot wear the weight belts yeah. to like help their back, but then they actually get hurt more when they're not wearing it. So, you know, so I can kind of tell with, with her, like she, she does, you can kind of see her, her upper back is trying to pull backward, you know, like a little more of an arch here. And we want that to come, you know, you want to have some, but just not as much. Cause that's going to yeah. put a lot more, are you getting headaches too? Or yeah, I yeah. Get headaches pretty typically quickly. with that type of forward head, you know, it's like the text neck on top of the, the, yeah. the upper back coming up, you know? Yeah. And I can always like, Throughout the day, I'm always kind of bending down and crunching, and it will Try, pop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, so. yep. It's okay too to have self pops like that. It's when you're aggressively trying to do it that yeah. that can start to create instability. Um, have you been adjusted before? No. No, first time. Okay, I'm gonna be yeah. gentle. Okay. Yeah, Not that I, I did wouldn't have a friend. be. She did. She's like going through school yeah and all that stuff so she she's done my neck okay a couple times but and you're okay like no i'm just teasing yeah <laughs> i'm like no <laughs> i think most of my issues came no, from people <laughs> people practicing on me back in the day yeah but just but just to reiterate so primary concern is kind of up in here and then the neck or also down here or is it all kind of all of it at once um i mean i get lower back pain yes quite a lot um, okay but i mean a lot of it all of it is, up in there yeah okay i'm gonna try Okay, I'll try a few different moves with you and then just try to see if we can get something that'll release a lot of, uh, hopefully stress and pressure. So what I'll have you do is I'm just gonna have you lay on your back, so you'll put your head right here, face up for me. And like I mentioned a minute ago, you probably overheard me that we can't break your bones, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? They're not gonna crack, they're not gonna fail yeah. any of that. It's just, it's no different than your hands. It's just different because it's your spine and we're realigning it, so. Um, but it is a very subtle, Subtle maneuver, but it will help release a ton of pressure. So not, not terrible in terms of mobility, but I do feel a few segments just feel, you know, and that again from your posture and the positions <laughs> you're in. So we're just going to be very subtle. Beautiful, beautiful. Feel okay? Yeah, yeah actually, I, I don't know why I love that noise. You know <laughs> what? It's, it's a love-hate relationship, you know what I mean? Most people love. Beautiful. Good. See, you're like our favorite customer. You know what I mean? You're not screaming and jumping off the table. Like you're actually, yeah, yeah. You're like, you're like, did you break something? No, we're like, yeah. we're actually going to help you out. So I'm going to try, I'm going to try a move where we kind of come straight down the center. Do you feel like it's pretty centralized or you feel like it's kind of one side more than the other? Uh, pretty central. Pretty centralized. Okay. Cause if it ever did gravitate, we'll kind of shift away. I'm just going to pull you down a little bit okay. and then, uh, there we go. If at any point you don't feel comfortable yeah, or if we can change anything, just let me yeah. know. Cause ultimately I want you to be as comfortable as you can. Take a breath in for me. Exhale for me. Good. You were gone already. You were already going. She was like pre popping. You know, that's a good sign. You know what that means? It means they wanted you to send them there sooner. You know what I mean? Yeah. Send me home. And we're just going to go a little bit lower right there. Take another breath in. Exhale for me. Good. Beautiful. Wow, those are good. Knocking oh, some stress dust. Like you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, melt it away. Good. All right. That's what we're hoping. That's what I'm hoping to find. Okay. Pelvis is a little twisted too. Are you right-handed? Yeah. Okay. So a lot of times you're right-handed. You will 
Well, obviously with anything, you're gonna be right or left. But when you're using, cause you're an artist, so you're doing a lot more repetitive yeah. than like me, like I'm on both sides more. Mm -hmm. So for you, you're gonna get a lot more, like with, with people that are unilateral, which means you're always using one side, you're gonna get more asymmetries, you know, kind of like a golfer, right? Like a golfer is always swinging the same way. So that's probably what's causing some of this discrepancy, but I'm gonna have you turn toward me and then we'll get this pelvis lined up for you. I'm gonna bring, um, yeah, you could, yeah. Whatever, like I said, get comfy, stay a while. I want you to feel good, good. This is the, the patented pretzel position. All right. Oh, a point I was gonna make too, is that a lot of time with females, adjusting their upper back when they're on their stomach isn't terribly comfortable because we're shoving their chest into the table. So that's why I like to modify it so we can keep them face up and address it without putting so much pressure. You know, it just makes it more comfortable for them. All right, and then I'm just gonna give a little pull here, beautiful. And we'll go right like this. And this will be gentle, I promise. Beautiful. Wow, that was perfect. Yeah. <laughs> the popcorn of life right there. Turn this way for me. Really good. And then we're just going to swing this leg here. Fantastic. Yeah, you're definitely the, the, the type we hope for. You know what I mean? Because you just, you're, you're excited to be adjusted. Good. Perfect. Oh, that was so good. Was so great. beautiful. <laughs> I'm going to do one more thing with her. So what I'd like to do is I'm going to maybe sit up. And we're going to turn this way. Actually, you know what? Why don't we flip you this way? It's a little easier this way. Sorry. So a lot of times with artists, whether they're makeup artists, paint artists, uh, tattoo artists, with her, she does have a lot of issue here. So a lot of times I like to do just a, a, a quick release of the traps and the muscle. So what I'm going to do, if it's okay, is I'm just going to kind of move your head as I apply pressure. If I apply too much pressure, let me know. How does that feel? That feels great. Does that feel okay? Yeah. yeah. So she's a fan of deep tissue therapy. I can already tell. Mm -hmm because I'm already getting my finger in there pretty good. But this helps release a lot because you get scar tissue from the head being held forward after a while. And we just like to free it up to help make you feel a little bit better. You don't want to do too long because then it can irritate it, but does that feel okay so far? Yeah, that's good. good. Perfect. Beautiful. Yeah, you are very tight up in the shoulders. Yeah. Not hard to figure out your line of work. <laughs> Okay, a couple more passes. Feeling all right? Yeah. Good. All right, you are ready to rock and roll. Oh, How you feel? So you feel good? So good. Beautiful.